Hi everyone, welcome back to Bag Buzz. My name is Paloma. And I'm Tammy. And today we are talking about our best everyday Louis Vuitton bags. Yes, I can start first. So I'm so excited, but there are some, you guys might say, overrated. I know the comments are gonna come for me, but it is absolutely a really great everyday bag and it is the Louis Vuitton Pouchette Métis. The reason why, I'll tell you what I look for in a really great everyday bag. Does it fit my essentials? Mm -hmm. Does it have versatility? Can I wear it easily, comfortably, every day, to work, shopping, grocery gro store, <laughs> grocery store, brunch, uh, dinner, mm -hmm. things like that, right? That's kind of like an everyday, I'm like, okay. So why did I choose this? I love it because it's a classic structure, has that top handle, you guys. A lot of these bags, you'll notice that it has this top handle function and it has that detachable strap. So it's easy to get in and out of, it's practical, secured. I mm -hmm. always look for a good, you know, easy to get in and out of. Has the dividers because, you know. I love the dividers. My life is a mess and if I don't have dividers, that's, you know, gets messier. And it has this back pocket function. That's functionality for me as a mom. I need somewhere that I can just quickly put my phone in or take out. And yeah, so this made our top six best Louis Vuitton everyday bags. What are your thoughts? I know a lot of you guys probably already have this bag, but I had to mention it and it had to make its appearance in this video. It's kind of classic at this point. I mean, what more do I have to say? I don't, I, I feel like this bag doesn't need convincing for you to want to buy it. What a lot of people don't like about this bag is that the Vachetta, right? The Vachetta is, you can get it in the reverse print and then it has the black handles, which I kind of like, but a lot of people like just the plastic monogram. So if you can find the infrarouge red print, oh. it's the black with red monogram. Mm -hmm. It comes with the black leather too. It's very rare, it's discontinued, but I kind of like that as mm -hmm. well. It's very edgy, but it's very rare. And would you buy this new or pre-owned? I would buy this 100% pre-owned. You guys save hundreds of dollars off retail price when you buy this pre-owned because retail price now is above around 3,300 Canadian after taxes. So I, you could get this pre-owned. It, it's gonna be an everyday bag. The last thing you want is you know the hardware is gonna get scratched up, especially if you don't let you leave the stickers on. So just get a pre-owned because you know you're gonna use it you're every use day. It. Use and abuse it, right? And you can save hundreds, like 500, 600 something. You know, even hundreds of dollars off, even if it is like new condition. Mm -hmm. so. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I think that's a great pick. My first pick as well. Another overrated Maybe bag. Maybe a little overrated, <laughs> overhyped, but very practical and functional is the Palm Springs. This is the mini size of the backpack. I would not go any bigger because then it becomes a full-fledged backpack. Uh, but the mini size is perfect because again, you have the top handle. You can always carry it like this if you want to be more casual, or you can kind of wear it as a backpack with the straps. But I've also seen people wear it almost like, kind of put it like across as like a, a bum mm -hmm. bag or a sling bag, which is really cool. Um, and again, you have the little front pocket. You can put like a lip gloss or something, you know, change if you need something like your bus pass, something quick access. Uh, if you're... Okay, maybe, you, maybe you don't, maybe if you're rocking this, you're not taking the bus. Yes. I'm just thinking if you were like on vacation, yeah, taking, okay, you know, sure. the metro in like, Paris. Oh, did you have to use that and not like... Your <laughs> bus pass has okay. everything, like a credit card would have been okay, nice. Okay, your lanyard, honestly. Uh, work pass. <laughs> your you lanyard, know? your work I would take the bus and save money on driving just so I could afford one yeah. of these. But look, to each one, okay, your lanyard, your yeah. lip balm, whatever. But anyways, uh, it's super spacious here. The dust bag is just inside, but as you guys can see, it is super spacious. It has a pocket here and the lining. Um, it's kind of like a nylon lining. Easy to clean. Easy to clean. Mm -hmm. You know, if you spill something, stain, easy to clean. You're not worrying about scratches, anything like that. And it's very spacious. You mm -hmm. can fit your phone, you can fit snacks. Like if you're a mom, maybe you're going to, on a trip or just kind of like, you like to be hands-free but carry stuff. It is really, really good. And it's a great size. It's not too backpacky. It still feels like a bag, mm -hmm. which is what I like. Get, get yourself the new zipper model so um, you don't have to deal with the pain of the old zipper model. If you guys know, um, the, old, the new zipper models come from like 2020 and above, but um, the old zipper models is a pain to zip up. That's, the, that's just my mm -hmm. one con with it, but the new zipper models, the zipper is now on the outside and it is um, convenient and easier to zip up. Just a little fact for you guys and a little tip for you guys. Exactly, and again, buy this one pre-owned. Yeah. I would not buy this brand new. Mm -hmm. You can, again, save hundreds and hundreds buying it pre-owned. And we see these coming in, like here at Lux du Jour. 
we get them. You know, they sell, but they always sell quick because there's yeah. such a good price on there's the pre-owned market. Long wish list for that. Long yeah. wish list, but if you can find it pre-owned, that's what I would recommend for that mm-hmm. one. Next right. bag, mine is gonna be the Louis Vuitton Clooney. Okay, and this one I love in the other prints, but if you want something subtle, this is the Epi leather, and right there is the Louis Vuitton um, logo. Super subtle, right? It's it's not decked out in monogram print, but this can come in the Damir Ebani um, and other prints like that. So let me show you guys why I love this. It's an everyday bag. This is a great work bag because it's so easy to get in and out of, even easier than the Pouchette mm-hmm. Métis. You have this magnetic closure, so you just lift up the flap and look at inside there. Slots for your cards, a zipper compartment to like even better than the dividers in the Oh Metis. yeah. Look at that. Oh, that's so even good. better than the dividers in the Pouchette Metis because it has a zipper compartment and has these smaller pockets. You can put an insert organizer in here and then create even mm. more um, you know, div- dividers. And I love it because you can carry this and Reminds me of the Alma, and I'm surprised we didn't put the Alma in here. But Alma, 100% made our top um, mm-hmm. six list, but we don't want to put too much like obvious Louis Vuitton classics in there. So I actually like the Clooney more than the Alma because the Alma you have to zip around like this, whereas this one's so much easier, right? And then you can wear it like right here. It fits everything you may want. It can fit this size, the MM, can fit your iPad mini. Um, And it doesn't have a back pocket, which I don't like, but um, that's okay. And then, you know, the strap is just like that. It's perfect. perfect. Right over your shoulder. You can carry your laptop bag still if you want. You can carry your lunchbox still. Mm -hmm. Um, Your diaper bag if you're mom. And the strap is removable too, which is nice. Mm -hmm. And I think this is a bag that you can actually you know, go to brunch with and still dress up, right? Mm-hmm. A cute little black dress. Like I think, I think it still looks very appropriate. Very good for every day. Very good for casual as well. So yeah, I like how subtle it is. If you don't like the monogram um, or kind of the classic Louis Vuitton print, it's more of a if you know you know. If you kind of see the little logo, it's very subtle and very elegant. Mm-hmm. And I like the structure of it too. I like how structured it is. Yeah. Go. Okay. And my next pick is also something really structured. It's not the Louis Vuitton Neverfull because that one is again quite high. But this is the Louis Vuitton Celea. So it kind of has that never full shape and that structure. But what I love about this one, it's got the zipper on the top. You guys know with tote bags, sometimes a big kind of fear that you have is like, oh, if my bag falls over in the car, in the shopping cart, your stuff goes getting flying everywhere. Getting pickpocketed. Yes, right at the grocery store getting, or getting pickpocketed and just having it on your shoulder. Yeah. So this one is great because it has the zipper, it has the security, and it also has two pockets, which is really nice. Um, but it's super spacious. Oh, and it has the little tab for your keys, mm-hmm. which I love. I love, that's like such a little feature, but it's, you know, put your work lanyard or something. This would be another really good work bag. You could fit your iPad mini, your iPad, a small laptop, uh, really comfortably in here. You could honestly even fit like a water bottle if you needed to. Yeah. It's a great everyday bag. Let me show you guys. Super comfortable to wear. Yeah, I agree with you. I love Not this one oversized. more than the Neverfull because of that security. Mm-hmm. And if you can get it in the Damir Ebeni print, and it comes with the brown handle. Yes, yeah, so exactly. If you love the non vachetta look, yeah. get it in the brown uh, print, right? Mm-hmm. So let me show you guys the size on me. This is Perfect such a size better for size too. for me than the Neverfull. You guys know with the Neverfull, you're never filling that bag up. Hence why it's called the Neverfull. So this is a Salea looks like it but it it functions similar like it but and you can leave it open if you want to this is a great work day everyday bag yeah i agree and not to mention the price of this one especially pre-owned um is way more affordable than the neverfull yeah if you are new to louis vuitton you're looking for something good easy every day you can get the salaya for amazing prices i think this one's listed at lux du jour for only 1200 canadian that's like 900 usd way cheaper than way the cheaper. Louis Vuitton Neverfull and it's because it's discontinued but that doesn't mean that it's outdated to, to me. This looks like a classic style. It's very classic. The yeah. shape is classic. Obviously the print is going to be super classic and for an everyday bag 900 USC, 1200 Canadian for something that you really just want to be able to toss around yeah. and the canvas of course is very durable. Mm-hmm. Everyone has a Neverfull. If you want mm-hmm. something different from everyone else, grab the, the Salea. Salea. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Or the Totally. Or the Totally. Both I like those. the Totally. Too. Yes. Mm-hmm. So my next bag, my last pick for the top six is the Louis Vuitton, I'm gonna botch this name, butcher this name so bad, 
Montag. Don't come for Tammy with her Don't French. Don't come, please. Don't please. come, please. I'm ESL. Okay. So this is in the perfect size for me. I love it because it has the perfect amount of space that I need for every day. This one already comes with the insert organizers, which I love. Like, love when people already invest into right. insert organizers. But let me show you the dividers. These dividers are even better mm -hmm. than the Louis Vuitton Clooney and the Louis Vuitton Pouchette Métis. Because I'll show you how many yeah. different... Um, dividers are in this one. I will say Louis Vuitton does it very well in terms of functionality. Yeah, like their bags are obviously luxurious designer, but they're really functional, which I love. So it's cut in right in the middle, and it has this nice zipper compartment right in the middle. But it has this big pocket right here, as well so as two more pockets, pockets down on in pockets. there. Yeah, pockets on pockets. And this one's in the Bernice print, but of course you can get this in other classic prints like the. Um, um, Demi Arbeni or Azure and yeah I love it because it has this long strap that can go cross body I'll kind of show you guys on me and strap of course is removable Louis yeah. Vuitton always has removable straps not like Chanel they're trying yes. to make their straps not removable <laughs> to really play with us over here they're like you can't buy the that bag with a detachable strap you need to buy a different bag with no strap mm -hmm. okay but yeah Louis Vuitton does it so well and then I'll show you guys um, I wish the strap was adjustable though, that's the one thing, because mm -hmm. this one drops a little bit low on me, I'm, I'm shorter, five, five feet, and then look at it crossbody. The reason why this, I think this makes a good everyday bag is the, the opening, it, it doesn't have a closure, but it can clasp a little bit close like this, but it doesn't do much. The thing is, it's not big enough that I'm worried about someone pickpocketing because it's such mm -hmm. a small closure, but it's really easy for me to get in and out of, see? So, and then hence all the, you know, the pockets and dividers. And I could really remove the strap and one more thing, make it look really good with my current outfit. And it looks really, that body is also really classic looking. Mm -hmm. okay. And right? very structured. Again, yeah. you guys know I love the structured bags. Yeah. Okay. And last but not least, <clears throat> this one is kind of maybe a bit hyped, but it's a little bit different. Um, so this is, of course you guys know this Speedy, but this is a Speedy Bandolier. So this one has the strap. Adjustable. The adjustable strap, not to mention. So the regular Speedy, as classic as it is, my one gripe with it is that the handles are so short and there's no strap, right? So if we're going to the grocery store or you know being out with your kids and stuff, you're not gonna be wanna you're not gonna want to hold it in your hands. You're gonna wanna use the strap sometimes or for travel. Yeah. So the bandolier version makes an amazing everyday bag because of the strap. But what I what I do love about the Speedy, again, oh, and this one has an insert organizer in it. Um, it's what this is one of those bags I'd recommend getting an organizer mm -hmm. for. It is just so spacious. Like you can fit yeah. so much stuff in here. Is there anyone that's ever filled up a Speedy dirty? Or no. forever hold your peace? Because no, there, seriously. I made my case. Seriously, I don't even have enough stuff no. to fill this with. Exactly. <laughs> like, I would have to fill the contents yeah. of my house yeah. into this bag, yeah. right? And what's great is, yeah, that travel aspect. Mm -hmm. If people wear, carry this as like a carry-on, it fits a good amount of stuff, especially if you Ooh. find it in the size 35 mm -hmm. or 40 as well. Yes, and I'll show you guys the strap. Of course, super comfortable for a little airport outfit. Every day I'm going to the grocery store. I'm a busy woman. I got a lot to carry. And of course, because it's adjustable, you can do it crossbody. Super straightforward. And again, the strap just and the stripe just adds a really nice touch. I think it makes yeah. it a bit more sophisticated. Um, it's spacious, but it's still structured. But it's not the everyday speedy that you're always holding in your hand with a little bit of with the top handles, because that is a complaint that I've heard from clients before. Yeah. So I'll show you guys the size 30 on me. Of course, like if you're smaller, get this one in the size 25 if you want, mm -hmm. right? This one's a little bit bigger on me. I think it'll look great as work or travel. You guys need to put, you want water bottles in here, diapers in here. Honestly, this That's would be, make a good mom bag as good well, mom right? Bag, Especially sure. with those insert organizers and you have those dividers. Yeah, this is a really great everyday bag as well. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so if you guys love that video, let us know what kind of video you guys want to see next and we will do them for you. Comment below what's your go-to everyday Louis Vuitton bag and we will see you in the next video. Bye! Bye.